Hi, today I'm going to talk about social media addiction. Social networking is communities where people online can create individual and public profiles, interact with real friends and friends from far, far away, and meet other people based on shared interests. Recently, through the past few years, social media has been expanding exponentially. There are many problems that exist within the social media communities that have been growing within the social media communities that could have been basic solutions. As the social media world has been growing, people have been connecting less with each other, friends and family will be sitting together all staring at the screen, not communicating at all. The lack of communication that social media causes changes in, pe in people's relationships. From emails to texting to innocent messaging, people are constantly avoiding face-to-face -face interaction, causing them not to be able to handle con confrontation and would rather hide behind a screen instead of talk to someone face-to-face. -face. Social media is affecting everyone, especially teenagers and mainly students. Students nowadays are addicted to their phones and social media. They sometimes skip classes and ask their friends to send them what they did in class via social media. This leads to lack of knowledge and education for teenagers, which is a major problem for, for every country that her youth have lack of education because they spend the time they were supposed to be studying on social media. This is a very big problem for every country. It has become a problem during school. Teachers are constantly reminding students that they need to put their phones away and pay attention in class. Moreover, in a family gathering, if you watch this gathering, you will see that they talk to each other for approximately 5 minutes and then everyone starts to hold their phones to go on social media and communicate with people behind their phones instead of communicating with each other. This makes families no longer closer to each other because they rather communicate on social media of gathering together anymore. This also to, leads to a very big problem which is cyber, cyber bullying. Most boys nowadays hide behind screen and would rather call you out through social media than bullying you face to face. The problem with cyberbullying is that bullies who used to be in schoolyards threatening to beat up someone if they didn't give, give them their lunch money are now online posing as anyone they want in order to avoid being caught. This is a major issue with social media. Solutions to this problem may, may seem simple but are rather complex since today kids refuse to give up their technology. A simple solution could be easy. To take away cell phones and laptops during family or friends nights so that more people communicate rather than stare at their screen. Recently, I went to a dinner with 20 of my friends and the first half of the dinner everyone just stared at their cell phones and didn't even have conversation. Halfway through, we made a rule for everyone to put their phones away in the middle and if you touch it, you have to pay the bill. This made the dinner a lot more enjoyable as people were communicating instead of staring at their screen. Also, as a solution for students to concentrate in class, students should not be allowed to take their phones with them to school and if a teacher finds out that the student has their phone, has or has her phone, she, she or he should take it and keep it until the end of the year. By not, t by not talking face to face, people lose communication skills that can hinder them from getting a job. Cyberbullying is a major topic and it's hard one to fix. The most ba basic solution would be more punishment for kids getting caught doing this and laws against cyberbullying since it could affect a person's life and everyone seriously. Problems with social media have been growing rapidly and people need to stop using it to hide behind the screen and communicate less. If these problems with social media don't stop, there could be bad outcomes and less social media addiction.